Welcome to another episode of Beard Bites. I'm in the hills of Aaron Huez. You can see it behind me and we are jump diving into some chicken today. It's Louisiana chicken. It's Popeyes. Let's open it up and dive straight into it. We'll see what this does to my beard. I want grease. I want it. It smells absolutely delicious. Let's go. Let's get an easy one first, a drumstick, and let's dive into it. Let's get nice and close. Mmm. Wow. Well, Juicy, salty. Oh, wow. Very hot. Mm. Crunchy, nice and moist. Mm. So far. The beard isn't getting hit so bad. But this kind of chicken is almost like a silent killer. You're going to have grease on your beard without even knowing it. You're going to have that saltiness on your beard as well without even knowing it. Because I can taste that salt devouring that guy. Okay. So far, dips are very, very greasy. So I know that beard is getting hit as well. So that's one piece. Let's go for one more. Mm, nice. Okay, a little bit of a different piece now. Look at that guy. Okay, I don't even know where to start with this. So let's, again, let's go straight in, side view. Oh. Oof. Hot. Hope you can see how, how juicy it is. And yeah, never had Popeye's chicken. So it's uh, it's nice, it's tasty. Tasty, but I don't have a lot of experience of chicken. Maybe a bit of KFC in the past, but it's good. Definitely a little awkward to eat. Now, for example, I want to get this piece here. So I really just have to dive into it. Face is full of grease. We've got some chicken coating on the beard now as well so it's starting to happen mm. oh we're adding like to see that when we're going to stuck in no napkins needed I'm going straight through then we're going to clean up afterwards so all right like I said you're gonna walk away from this one thinking that your beard is clean and then half an hour later you're gonna get that waft of chicken smell if you don't clean your beard properly. So we're gonna make sure we do that. Messiness rating. Because you have to really get in there, like I am. We had a squid sandwich first day. We had a burger the second day. The chicken is surprisingly a lot more messier than the squid sandwich. And I'm almost saying it's a bit more messier, messier than the burger as well. Because what? You've coating, chicken coating all over my beard. You absolutely have grease all over the beard for sure. And it's, just, it's one it's stuff that you can't see. I know from my hands, that grease. I know from my hands are so greasy. My beard is definitely greasy as well. So let's start that cleanup. Because I know there's grease on my beard, I'm going straight for the wet wipe. Usually, look at my fingers. I gotta clean my fingers now first before I go touching that beard. So wet wipe, clean the fingers. Usually I would grab my comb first to get rid of all of this, but I'm not because that's gonna transfer that chicken grease onto my comb. Well, my comb which broke because I smashed it on a tile floor yesterday. So that's a bit unfortunate, but it's still gonna work. Only brought one over, over with me to my trip to Madrid, Aaron Huez today. So we're gonna get that that a beer, a baby wipe first to get rid of that. So, mm, let's have a close up. Okay, let's get rid of that now first. Baby wipe it. Then let's get, now let's get in with that comb, brush away that chicken coating. And then, of course, as always, one drop of beard oil on your baby wipe. And we finish with a little bit of that scent on the beard 
really be thorough on this one because like I said, you can't see that chicken grease. So you want to be thorough. Get that nice scent on, comb it out again. Make sure you twist that moustache. That was Popeye's Louisiana chicken. There we have it. It was a good one. Messy rating, sorry, I'm gonna give you that messy, messy rating. It, I would say that would be a seven. I'm gonna give the, the squid would be a three. I'm gonna give that burger five and Popeye's Louisiana chicken. We're gonna give you a seven for the messy beard rating. That's episode number three of Beard Bites in the Bag. Hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one.